Oh. oh my gosh. I totally did not know there's a deactivate and activate button, I'm so sorry. Anyway, let's see what's the f the Anyway, first of all, hello chat. <laughs> yep, surprise, um this is a rare um weeknight stream. And I just found out that um about the Nintendo Direct from R3 Play something, so I decided so even though I do not own a uh, Nintendo D Direct, I still feel like I should check check the N Nintendo Direct to see what the um, games that be available because there's no harm in checking out uh, the Nintendo Direct, right? Even though I do not own a, a, a Nintendo, um, what was the latest console again? Oh, the Switch! Yeah, the Switch. It's a Switch. Splatoon 3 Expansion Pass. Hold on, let me... Um... Oh, crap. Okay. Let me grab my phone before. Hello. Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. You just saw oh, a this new guy trailer again. for Wave 2 of the Splatoon 3 Expansion Pass DLC, Side Order. This brand new story is set in the Spire of Order, where you'll strengthen your character's abilities as you ascend the Spire's floors. We're developing this single-player DLC so it can be also played right, over this, and uh, over again. The PlayStation State of Play will be later on around 5 a.m. in the morning, so which, I, which is very likely that I will be... Very late, I'll okay, be watching it live let's see because there's no way I can wake up at 5 Nintendo in the Switch headlines. The toys, the toys are back, are in, are town. back in town. <laughs> Donkey Kong. Mario. The rivalry oh, that Mario heated up on the Donkey Game Boy Kong Advance Kong. system reignites on the Nintendo Switch system. With his eyes on the prize, Donkey Kong has stolen all the mini Mario toys from the factory. Oh, no. And it's up to Mario to track him down. In each stage, contraptions and other challenges await. Observation and action are vital to your success. Yeah, this is a very last minute. Mario needs to reach the key, but he can't quite cross the gap. Hmm. Oh dear, spikes. That monkey's Crap. tail looks a little suspicious though, doesn't it? If Mario does this, now he can get across. Okay. And safely grab the key. Platform too high? Reach it with a handstand jump or a backflip. Like okay. that. Observe and yeah, okay. act to collect okay. mini Mario's, clear stages, and oh, face yes. Donkey Kong head on. And yes, I'm using my phone as my channel. In this updated version of the game, you can play with a friend okay. in local co-op. However you choose to puzzle your way through, it's up to you to recover the toys. Interesting. Mario vs. Donkey Kong launches on Nintendo Switch February 16th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Alright, okay. Next! Save the Prince and the World. Prince of Persia? Prince Guide of Persia! Sargon as he sets off to save the Prince of Persia and restore the world's balance. Tapping into the roots of the Prince of Persia oh series, this game features 2D, side-scrolling action-adventure gameplay. Dash through breathtaking environments in a mythological Persian inspired world, but don't linger too long if you hope to survive. Harness sword and bow techniques, as well as time powers, to best these hostile lands. 
As your journey progresses, Game Sarkov will hand grow stronger really and learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Equip amulets to further boost your abilities, among other perks. Where the camera is, um, the number is, of amulets that, you can equip is like, limited, though. Where so choose the wisely. Is like, um, Use everything like at your disposal to navigate the, this harsh the, world terms, yeah. and defeat the mythical beasts that stand exercise. in your way. Give me Get ready to save the prince and discover the mysteries of Malkath. When Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown, launches on the Nintendo Switch system January 18th. Is he only available on the, the on the Nintendo Switch within or the, by the, available the on other um, platforms as well? These games will help you chase your passions. Passions? Rev up for true arcade racing in Horizon Chase 2. Speed through stunning oh, environments, each games. with its own okay. dynamic art style, while overtaking your rivals on the road. Play the main this campaign fun. to unlock vehicles, courses, and more. Kinda you miss can the also when I use upgrade a, uh, your vehicle play, um, and style to fit your high-octane needs. Itching for more racing action? Up to four speedsters can put the pedal to the metal in couch yeah. co-op or online. Go full throttle in Horizon Chase 2, launching on Nintendo Switch later today. Warm later today, up for musical mayhem mm -hmm. in this rhythm-based adventure. Time your button Super presses crazy with the music rhythm to castle. solve puzzles and battle bosses. Over 30 thrilling and tracks of away, Konami, including right? music from iconic Konami Still, games. Still, uh, it's been like what? Up to four One friends year? can battle it out Since in the, versus uh, modes, or jam together in local or Since online. Since the announcement Super on uh, Crazy Rhythm Castle launches on Nintendo Switch and November 14th, ever since then, right, there has, has not been any news Nintendo regarding Wii Silent Hill 2 remake. What? Anya Forger has a new assignment. Spy X Anya Operation Memories. On weekdays, you'll head to class. Then enjoy family time in the evenings. On days well, off, this is unexpected. All sorts of exciting places, like the beach or an art museum, in search of subjects to photograph. How will you spend your time with friends and family? And what kind of photo diary will you help Anya make? Spy Anya Operation Memories launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Next year. Okay, but well, that was kind of ex Mario's unexpected. First RPG adventure yeah, I didn't know about this. This was announced during the last, the, um, Super Mario RPG the last game Nintendo Direct. With the um, graphics. Mario Let's RPG is getting a, a remake. Gameplay features. Time your button presses with action commands to increase damage dealt or decrease damage received. When you time your attacks perfectly, you can now damage all enemies at once. Every successful action command will fill this gauge. When it's full, you can unleash the three character triple move. Huh, interesting. Depending on your current party, the move will change. So experiment with different combos. During your adventure, you'll encounter bosses with colorful personalities. After clearing the game, you can fight some of them again. But these powered up bosses post game be boss easy. rematches. Ah, okay, cool. Set off for adventure with Mario and friends when Super Mario RPG launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 17th. And it's released on for my birthday. Available now Brilliant. On Nintendo e -shop. Unfortunately, as I mentioned earlier, I do not. Oh. <sighs> Look alive. We're almost there. What is this? <gasps> the Nintendo DS game Trace Memory returns on the Nintendo Switch system as another code to memories. Okay. One day, a young girl named Ashley receives a letter from the father she thought had passed away. Seeking answers, she sets off for the solitary Blood Edward Island in search of him. Once there, oh, this better not be some encounters game puzzles some and obstacles that hinder her investigation. Is this some exploration puzzle game of some sort? Can you see me? 
She also meets a I'm mysterious sorry, I have boy. I have absolute zero knowledge when what it comes to the Ashley in this games. place. And no matter how hard I mean, regarding I try, this game, I can't remember Dad's face. Who are you? The sequel, another code R. Journey into lost memories, previously unreleased in North America, is also included. So this is like Juliet, huh? Play both games to experience the full story. Unravel both adventures, fully enhanced for Nintendo Switch, when another code, Recollection, launches January 19th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Cool. Another code recollection cool. includes two games, the Nintendo DS game Trace Memory and its Wii sequel which was never released in North America. Both games are fully enhanced on Nintendo Switch. Please look forward to playing them early next year. Next, please take a look at this. Alright, what's next? Oh! The, the princess game that was um, teased day, during the last Nintendo Direct. presented a flyer advertising a show at the Sparkle Theater. Princess Peach and some Toads went to go see it. But then... <laughs> the Wicked Grape and the Sour Bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took center stage. Now, it's up to Peach and the theater's guardian Stella to save the play and the day. This perfect performance has become a terrible tragedy. Oh yeah. Luckily, Peach can use the power of Stella's ribbon to face off against the Sour Bunch. Interesting. The ribbon alone won't always cut it though. So let's do this. Henshin. Whoa, Peach transformed into Sword yep. Fighter Peach. Henshin. By transforming, she can use fantastic show-stopping abilities. Fend off the Sour Bunch with sensational sword play. Interesting. Can Peach save this performance and its performers? I wonder if this game gives you the option to hedge into other shows forms to of save. Peach, you know. Even though the I do not play, from this and museum have gone missing. Become that Peach. <laughs> looks like my question has been answered. <laughs> you can hedge into uh, other forms of uh, Peach as well. Desserts so so far we have seen sword play. And then uh, detective, Peach, and then and yes, there's a sugar crash. Um, chef, um, chef the Peach. The sour bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Become Kung Fu Peach and take it back from these Kung foul Fu beings. Peach. Many other transformations are just behind the curtain. The stage is set. Our leading lady is ready for the spotlight. Very interesting. Princess Peach, showtime. Makes ah. its debut on Nintendo Switch, March 22nd. Right. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. That was a new look at Princess Peach Showtime. In Peach's latest adventure, the gameplay changes depending on her transformations. It looks like there are more transformations beyond the ones we showed today, so please stay tuned. Let's continue with some more headlines. One. A new saga begins. A new saga begins? A multi-layered RPG full of rich stories awaits in Saga Emerald Beyond. Oh, okay. There are six heroes to choose from. A young man who fights with sentient puppets. A witch disguised as a schoolgirl to mask her identity. Okay. A crime-fighting duo Spain, chasing down a mysterious organization. A songstress mech who lost her voice and body. Wow. And a king of darkness who was recently reawakened. Select a hero, then follow their journey through 17 interconnected worlds as they strive to achieve their goals. Okay. How the story unfolds is in your hands. The choices you make can unlock different paths, more than ever before seen in the Saga franchise. 
fight in timeline battles, turn-based combat in which turn oh, order is crucial me to victory. RPG game. Use special techniques to control the order of actions, or activate team combos to swing the tide of battle in your favor. Interesting. Saga Emerald Beyond launches on Nintendo Switch next year. The Legendary Raider returns. Tomb Raider? The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing onto Nintendo Whoa. Switch in one daring collection. As the fearless archaeologist, Lara Croft, you'll travel the world and face off against deadly foes and even deadlier legends. Climb, backflip, and swan dive through perilous quests spanning different countries and mythologies. Wow, the Along graphic the way, looks way better in the, puzzles to in the treasures version. of the ancient world. And speaking of which, right, I really should check out the the, the, the this second and third game of the trilogy comes with all of the, the Tomb Raider game and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle between the original polygon look and the upgraded visuals at any time. Wow. Okay. One through three cool. remastered, starring Lara and it's Croft, available on Valentine's Day. The irony. Pre-orders begin today <laughs> on Nintendo eShop. Well, is wait, is it Nintendo Switch um, exclusive? It's got a second bolt of brilliance. Or will be available in, on other platforms as well. Every great detective starts their day early. This is Rhyme City, a place where humans and Pokemon coexist. The detective duo of Pikachu and his partner Tim investigate various cases while searching for Harry, Tim's missing father. Tim interviews people, Pikachu interviews Pokemon, and they find the truth together. They'll also rely on other Pokemon to broaden the scope of their investigations. Follow Sense with Growlithe. Okay. Smash Rocks with Darmanitan. And Peer Through Walls with Luxray. Interesting. Can Tim and Pikachu solve all the mysteries and find Harry? Find out when Detective Pikachu returns. Oh, Launches that's the next on Nintendo month. Switch, October 6th. Pre orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. This game's a real toot. Huh? Oh, I s I seen this in the one of the your, your, the your video game stream. Trombone champ. Play the notes in time with the music as best you can. But how you play that horn is up to you. I've seen this game in one of uh, your video games uh, as stream to adjust the pitch up and down. Not really stream, but more of like or one of their, uh, on the right their stream compilation. The controls are pretty unique, and mastering every control scheme won't be a walk in the park. Huh. Your way through nearly 50 songs spanning various genres, from classical Wait. to electronica and everything in between. Plus, up to four musicians can band together in local multiplayer. Huh. Okay. Trombone Champ slides onto Nintendo All Switch available later, later today. today. Interesting. Battle your way to victory in these Nintendo Switch games. What? Ten teams of three will duke it out for survival in this online battle royale brawler. Oh, a multiplayer game which Knock I will have down to absolute zero, and zero interest because or shut I'll be frank, collapsing terrain to I'm win. not into multiplayer games. Choose from 15 heroes, each inspired by a different because I'm more of a, I'm more with your allies to be the last a solo team standing. Player. I'm more Battle into Crush is free to play like and launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next spring. A closed beta test will be available this October. Lead your mercenaries to fame and fortune in this open world tactical what RPG. Is? Take up various contracts from protecting townsfolk from thieves to vanquishing the land's most notorious figures. Before battle, equip your mercenaries with the best gear and skills to claim victory and live to see another day. 
Up to four players online can jointly command a troop and journey together across this vast world. War Tales launches as a timed console exclusive on Nintendo Switch later today. Run and gun in this reimagining of the beloved NES classic, oh. Contra. Contra? Blast through explosive okay. stages with a devastating arsenal of weapons to crush the Red Falcon forces. Wow. Spring into action with easy pick up and play controls and a variety of this difficulty options. This old school options. game is getting a, this re uh, of Konami and a remaster? A Features Holy new crap. weapons, enemies, powerful super attacks, and a four player co op mode. Contra wow, Operation Konami Galuga is, storms onto the Nintendo Switch system. Konami is early really next stepping year. up the, the game, man. Then, from the way I see it, liberate your kingdom, but still, reclaim your destiny. We need more news on Silent Hill 2 remake, though. It is a grievous tale which speaks of Febrith, one of stolen destiny, stolen minds, okay, what is this? and stolen nations. Yet, as the world stands consumed by immense evil. A fallen prince shall rise again, ring of legend lighting his path. That is the ring of the unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Legend speaks of your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. Yet the answer is clear as day now. The path before us is laid bare, and all that remains now is to walk Another it. RPG walk it game, the way I see it. Freely traverse an expansive world, gather new allies, forge your bonds, and lead the liberation to glorious victory. Cultivate a grand army with over 60 and why the characters, from kind of reminds me of um, to the massive beasts Traveler. and heavenly angels. Today marks our first. This better than not be another spray heavy over our home. It may take days, months, or even years. But I shall see the duties of my bloodline fulfilled. Atlas, Atlas? and Vanillaware present the rebirth of tactical fantasy RPGs. Unicorn Overlord. Okay. Available March 8th, 2024. <laughs> oh, right. The Luigi. The new Luigi game that was un announced during the last Nintendo Direct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. Luigi, our faint of heart hero, was sent here to check it out. Time for some mansion mayhem. No spooky adventure is complete without this vacuum-like device, the Poltergust. Okay. Use it to light up dark areas, vacuum up objects, and interact with the environment. It's a handy tool for your paranormal escapades. All right. Plus, when you spot a ghost, pop! You can stun them with the strobe ball, then vacuum them up. Okay. You can even grab multiple ghosts at once. Cool. In this game, you'll find ghosts haunting, a former plant research lab, a broken down clock factory that's full of sand, a okay. mine covered in ice and snow, and even more places. These troublemakers will use every trick in the book to block oh. your path. Can Luigi summon his courage and save the day? Looking for other ghost hunters? Up to four players online can do some exercise across different multiplayer modes. What? Luigi's Mansion 2 HD creeps onto you can Nintendo play Switch single player next summer. Mode, which is very cool. How was that? Next, we have two announcements to share. First, Please take a look at this video. Two announcements. Uh, what is this? What is this? 
What's that? It's a large question block. Actually, this question block currently appears on the roof of the previously announced Nintendo Gallery that's under construction in Uji City, Kyoto Prefecture. Oh. The official name of this gallery will be the Nintendo Museum. At the Nintendo Museum, a wide variety of Nintendo products from the company's history will be displayed. Construction is going well, and we plan to finish up by March 2024. Where is he located we'll share again? more information, such as the opening date, at another time. Please stay tuned. Next, we'd like to share some updates on upcoming Amiibo figures. The Zelda and Ganondorf Amiibo figures, figures are releasing on November 3rd. Uh, yeah, yeah. And Amiibo figures of Noah and Mio from the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game will be released as a set on January 19th. Where's the girl with the British accent? Finally, we have a new Amiibo figure. Where's the now? girl with the British accent, buddy? The DLC fighter from Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. <laughs> Sora <laughs> from Kingdom <laughs> Hearts <laughs> is on the way. With the release of Sora, everyone is here from Super Smash Brothers Ultimate in okay. Amiibo form. Please look forward to its release next year. That's all I, for today's I have not, Amiibo I have not played Zeno. Um, next, please take a look at this. Am I? Hold on. Hold on. New city one. Okay, we're getting some old school retro game. The first F Zero game. Ah, F Zero. Whoa! Player Battle Royale. F Zero ninety nine. Wow. Race on classic F Zero courses with machines from the original Super NES game. Tear through wow. courses in high speed races, but be careful. Your power meter will decrease if you crash into pilots or guardrails. If it hits zero, you're out. Bye bye. You'll need to wow. avoid collisions and conserve your power this, meter to stay in the race. Is this a, re a remake? Feeling or risky? Or, or, Spend or some of your power master. meter for a temporary speed boost. And wow, look at the, the graphics, man. Holy crap. You can also collect super sparks, which appear when machines collide to boost up to a special path called the Skyway. It's your best chance at bypassing your rivals and jumping into a higher position. Complete goals while you're racing to unlock cosmetic options for your machine. Right? Ninety-nine players, one winner. It's time to race your way to first place. Because F-099 will be available exclusively for active Nintendo Switch Online members later today. Free. But well, only if you're an online member. More than 30 years after its original release, F-0 is back as a Battle Royale game. This title also supports the Super NES controller available exclusively wow. for Nintendo Switch Online members. We hope you will give it a try and aim for first place. Okay, let's continue with some more headlines. One little hero, one humongous problem. Right. Welcome to Vandal City, a whimsical land inhabited by small fuzzy beings called Yordles. After a party Vandal gets a Hill, little too a wild, the story. portals holding the land together collapse and throw everything into chaos. It's up to you and your knitting magic to stitch Vandal Is City some back sort together. Of, um, Journey across the land to gather materials story and craft some items sort. and meals for the locals. As you continue and gathering friend, and crafting, you can weave together new upgrades by unlocking more Leave branches of the before. skill tree. Like, Enchant your never. experience even further by embarking on quests and hosting festivals for the community. Can you save Vandal City? And what mysteries will you discover during your magical adventure? Vandal Tale, a League of Legends story, launches on Nintendo Switch next I mean, even year. Even the company is by Riot Forge, so is she. Wait, did you hear that? Join best friends, Nunu and Willem, on a journey across the frozen wilds of the Freljord. Okay. Jump, climb, and 
and sled your way through a beautiful yet treacherous land, where every step taken and each puzzle solved will bring you closer to the truth about these friends and their past. Song of Nunu, Song a of League Nunu. of Legends story, launches another, on the Nintendo yeah. Switch system November 1st. Pre orders Is this begin another uh, League of Legends or origin story? Because in the face from, from Riot. Let's move into formation. Okay. Play with these chumps doesn't feel like a prize. Greetings, ah. welcome to the island. This tropical resort contains tons of micro games that'll get your body moving. Okay. In each micro game, you'll get into a specific pose called a form. Right. Copy the form shown, then perform the correct action as quick as you can. Hand model. The micro games will come one after another, so look alive. Okay. Plus, up to four players can battle it out in party mode. Hmm. <laughs> this is uh, to do so. definitely a game for or the yo video games in an gang arena to be the last one posing. This is definitely a game for With the yo video games gang. Fast micro games and multiplayer modes are plenty. Everyone's in for a wacky time. WarioWare Move It launches on the Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. That's like one day um, after the release of um, Star Ocean, the Star Ocean Remaster. Lead an army of over 100 heroes into battle and put an end to an empire's invasion. Auden Chronicle 100 Adin. Noah, a humble villager. More Sadie, RPG. An officer from the Empire. And Marissa, a forest guardian. These three band together to fight for a common goal. On their journey, they'll meet a variety of heroes who can join their cause. This is your home base, known as the Headquarters. As mm -hmm. allies join you, additional facilities will become available. You'll be able to tend crops, open shops, and more. Each hero you encounter has their own backstory and motivation. They may not always get along at first, but these conflicts may strengthen the bonds between your heroes. Trust, betrayal, justice, and truth. A heroic tale will begin when Ayudin Chronicle 100 Heroes launches on Nintendo Switch April 23rd. Okay. Participate in some pixel perfect play. What? Next stop, Octopia. Travel to Eastward, a charming Octopia. parallel world okay. in this paid DLC for Eastward. Oh, is DLC. How Sam and John turn the pages of okay. a new chapter as they adjust to country life in a mountainside village. Tend to livestock, whip up culinary delights for your neighbors, and restore buildings to help the village thrive. And if you're new to Eastward, don't worry. You can access the DLC even if you haven't played the main story. Oh, Eastward okay. Octopia ventures onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Get back into the groove. In this sequel War to War Groove, okay. charge across three tactical campaigns with valiant factions, including a new mouse folk faction, the Fari. Plus, you can now supercharge your commander's group to unleash devastating attacks. Lead a roguelike offensive in conquest mode. Battle friends locally or online. Or create and share your own cutscenes and campaigns. War Groove 2 marches onto Nintendo Switch as a console exclusive October 5th. Get out of my way! Whoa, calm down that lady. On Nintendo eShop. Now what is this? Dive and catch fish by day. Then serve them as sushi by night in the aquatic adventure, Dave the Diver. Oh, okay. Use the fish you've caught to concoct recipes and create the day's menu. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. 
explore an ever-changing world to find the best ingredients and strive to exceed culinary expectations. What? Dave the Diver launches first for consoles on the Nintendo Switch system October 26th. Pre-orders and a free demo swim onto Nintendo eShop later today. The final wave is racing in. All right. Here's a sneak peek at wave six, the final wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. From the Mario More Kart DLC. Wii game, okay. Daisy Circuit. More returning characters are also being added in wave six. From the Mario Kart Double Dash game, Diddy Kong. From Mario Kart Wii, Funky Kong. From the Mario Kart Tour game, Pauline! And also, Peachette! Oh, okay. Wave 6 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game drives onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Cool. Something new is among us. Okay. I'm kind of amazed that Among Us is getting more updates. Considering the fact that this went, this went um, viral about um, a year or two, I forgot. What happened? Uh oh. And it exploded. Really? Oof. Introducing a new map. Ow. Welcome to the fungal. This new map for Among Us is free and launches this October. Next month. What did you think? Thanks for sticking with us this far. Next up, we'd like to recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can look forward to playing from September onwards. Let's take a look. All right, let me hear. As you. Pikmin, Detective Pikachu. These are in order of um, date, the release dates. Super Mario RPG, Mario Kart 8, another code with election, Mario vs Donkey Kong, Princess Peach, this here, Splatoon 3, Luigi's Mansion, we hope you're looking forward to these upcoming titles. This next video will be our last announcement. Ah, Please final announcement. So what is it? Okay. Okay. Why am I getting why am I getting the feeling that pe people who enjoy fans of Mario are going um, wild over this game? Wow. I can imagine um, fans of Mario going apeshit over this game. I might be wrong.
Paper Mario, the thousand year door. Thousand-Year Door, originally released on Nintendo GameCube, will return with enhanced graphics. Oh, it's a re it's it, a remaster. Okay. Adventure in a paper world starring Mario and friends. No wonder I'm getting a feeling why uh, when I when I was Nintendo looking Direct. at this game at the way that I was like, oh, thank you for watching. People, I had I had a gut feeling that people will go a shit over over this game, and I was right. <laughs> It turned out to be a remaster of a, a, a Nintendo GameCube game. And yeah, I think that's pretty much um, all of the games that has been announced on the uh, Nintendo Direct so far.